women especially these days are getting a lot of attention and validation from men on social media, whether it's Instagram or TikTok or uh, mm. even OnlyFans. Um, and some of these girls, as you'll, I'm sure, admit, Richard, they look good, brother. They look real good, okay? They got, you mm -hmm. know, not the, not the traditional sense of good, good heart. as, as, as <laughs> Dave Chappelle likes to say. I'm talking good, like they're wearing a turtleneck and the titties are popping out, like, this is good. The dress is half <laughs> up. I, I can't steal Chappelle's joke, but some of these women are ridiculously hot, especially on, on Instagram. What are the, 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 this is a major red flag, but uh, what's your advice on men pursuing women with, a million followers mm. on Instagram or that are doing the booty pics mm -hmm. on TikTok. What's your <laughs> advice for men in, in regarding these types of uh, clout chasers and Instagram tottery out there? Well, they're simps. I mean, there's, there's no way around it. If, if there's an unfair exchange because attention is the coin of the realm for women, she's getting free unlimited attention from all these guys, then what does he get in return? Now, this is where guys start to sign up for things like OnlyFans or they mm. subscribe to some Amazon wish list or some some garbage like that. But they're simps. I mean, I don't follow any thoughts on any social media platforms. Mm. Um, I don't DM them. I don't message them. Like, why? You know, for what? Um, it doesn't make any sense to me. But I understand. Like, they're thirsty for beautiful women and there's lots of beautiful women out on these platforms and they they sell you know they sell pick like sex sells it's 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 always sold right and the younger you are the healthier you are the more you're going to be interested in that you're never going to get away from that i mean i wouldn't touch a woman that had a prolific social media account with a 10-foot pole i mean look maybe if she's a social media uh fitness influencer and that's what she's always done her entire life and she's a total compliment to my life and has none of the red flags sort of thing mm -hmm. then i might let her maybe but for the most part, uh, I wouldn't deal with a woman that's got a public social media. You know, it's got to be private mm -hmm. yeah. or non-existent. Mm -hmm. Or non-existent. Yeah, yeah. That, that's some of the, uh, the problems. Those are the better are girls, in. right? What's that? Those are always the better girls, the girls with either private or non-existent social media profiles. You know, Richard, I, 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 I'm learning that the hard way, my friend. Let's just leave it there. <laughs> some we'll of these girls there, out Adam. there, they'll get you. They'll get you uh, there. But, you Uncle know, Rich will get you there's there, right? reciprocity, though. It's not like I... Um, not getting a message back, so to speak. So if you like that clip, click right here to watch another, or if you want to watch the entire SauceCast, click right here.